Okay, hello. This is going to be a very, um, the lighting is awful, a very relaxed video. I wanted to show you, um, my Christmas baubles, basically. My Christmas bubble collection. That is my cat. Um, and yeah, I wanted to show you my Christmas bubble collection because I have two trees, um, and quite a few Christmas baubles. I don't tend to buy new ones every year. I buy a couple every year, um, but not like a whole tree's worth every year. Uh, I tend to reuse the same. I've been reusing, reusing the same for like six, seven years, um, but I keep adding. Basically that's what I'm doing for my whole Christmas collection, so my lights, I buy one set of new lights every year, I buy like four, two or three bubbles every year, um, and yeah, so I wanted to show you my bubble collection. I will start with my tree upstairs because that one isn't done, and the bubbles are sitting out, and this lighting is awful. Not any better. Um, and then I'll show you our main tree. Um, and show you our bubbles in this one. Let's go upstairs. Okay, so you're balancing a little precarious, but I wanted to show you some of the um, decorations that are gonna go in this tree. I've not put them on yet. This tree's been up for a little while, but I've not put the decorations on yet. Hold on, I'm gonna make you slightly taller. Okay, now you're even more precarious. You're even more unstable now, you're balancing on like every single light box that I have. Um, so some of these decorations are old, some of these ones are new, but uh, I love them all. But a lot of these ones go on the downstairs tree, but since we have two this year, and we have a more pastel-y, iridescent kind of thing going on downstairs, these ones I thought would be better up here. So I'll just show you these ones. Um, so I've got this one, it's like a red, pretty solid ball and it's glittery and um, I think this one's from John Lewis, I believe. All of these are going to be from John Lewis, Mark Spencer's, uh, or Primark, or Primark. Um, but yeah, love that one. I've got this other, more delicate kind of bowl, red one again, with some gold detailing on it. Um, this one is from John Lewis. Um, I got it. I got both of these four, five, maybe even six years ago. Um, but yeah, I love this one. I think it's so nice. It's so pretty. Um, we tend to buy at least one new bottle every year, just to build up the collection rather than going like crazy every year. Mr. Dog, you're gonna have to move out of the way. Okay, so these are some of our pre-mark ones. They are like coppery and black and gold kind of. Um, we were going for like a copper, black and gold theme a couple years ago. I still really like these ones. I love this one, the white and gold one. That one could be quite nice downstairs actually. Um, but yeah, those ones. Um, I like that they're all slightly different. But yeah, I think this one could be quite a since there is the white and gold one that I love. We have these ones, which are the new ones for this year. So Disney, uh, Disney, this old Disney and Primark do these every year. And it's always different colours. They also have a black and red one, so kind of more traditional Disney colours this year as well. But we went for the orange and kind of burgundy, I guess. And gold. I loved all the orange. Like, everywhere seems to be like an orange scene this year and I just love it. Um, yeah, I love this one. I think this is really nice. Um, this is a great addition to our collection. Um, again, I wanted to put these ones upstairs because this is where all our Disney ones are going. And I thought the red would be really nice with like, all the blacks and oranges that we've got going on. And here is our big boy one. This is a Minnie Mouse one. Again from Primark like two, three, four years ago. Big, massive mini this one. I love the sparkliness of it. It's huge. Maybe a bit too big for this tree, but then we have these ones again, Mickey Mouse themed black and gold. I really like these ones again. 
Got a proper Disney thing going on in this tree, which I love. Here is another simple red one. It's a post box, quite traditional UK post box with snow on it. Um, yeah, I got this one from John Lewis, I believe, or Martin Spencer's five years ago. It's really solid. It's really nice. It's really good, like condition and quality. Um, I love it. It's great. It's good. It's good. It's good. I have this Merry Christmas bauble. Um, literally, I think it's just made from wood, like a really cheap wood. Um, but yeah, it says Merry Christmas. I have this one on all year round too. All year round. I have it on every single tree every year. I think I got this one from John Lewis or Martin Spencer's. Um, don't remember the price of it because it was years ago, but it's great. It's another one to the red collection. We have this massive box of bubbles that we got from, I think, B&M. Very, very inexpensive, so they're like really cheap kind of plasticky bubbles, but they're all just gold, copper, and black, shiny and clary. Um, and it comes with the gold star as well for the copper. I'm going to use these ones as like fillers for if we've got a lot of space left, but we're going to be able to put all these ones on, the other ones on, and if we have left, these will go on. And they're just great like fillers. So here is another one of the Disney ones. These are black and gold. Oh, and there's an orange one in there too. Um, so yeah, this is a mixture of, well, I'll take this bit off. Anyway, we'll see them better. Um, like gold, black and gold. Bubbles, Disney bubbles, the same as the orange ones that we bought this year. Um, and then we've got little Mickey hands. Got a black one and a white one in this pack. Um, but we've also got an orange one. Black and orange one. Which will go really nicely with the ones that we bought this year. So that is that. So that is what that one looks like. Same. I think that's it. I think I'm pretty sure we have one more box but I don't know where it is of the little Minnie Mouse ones. Mickey Mouse ones. Um, but that's it. That's the decorations that are going on this tree. So let's carry on with the rest of the tour. Okay, so now, God sake, this lighting. Anyway, <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll show you this tree here. This it is like an amalgamation of like bubbles from multiple different years. Um, I wanted to do this in the daylight originally because I thought that'd be better for showing you the bubbles. But it's now night time and it's now dark because it gets like dark three o'clock here. Um, but I'll show you the bubbles anyways. So here's a little overview of our tree. Um, I've kept the lights off because I thought that would just be better for showing you the decorations. Um, where to start? Uh, you probably saw from the little overview there that we don't really have a colour scheme. Um, it's been multiple different colour schemes over the years. Uh, it's just kind of whatever we fancy really. Um, so, we've got quite a few deer. I don't think I'll be able to find them all, but if you can spot them all, props to you. So, this one... Um, I can't remember when we got this. Like this was a couple years ago. Maybe actually was this one last year? This one I think was next last year. Um, and then we've got another white stag here, which was from Asda. I love that they all look like they're like jumping through the trees branches. It just did nice. Um, and then we've got a little gold one fawn down here, which I thought was dead cute. And then we've got the new fawn one this year, so this was one of the new additions um, a little brown fawn um, it's identical to the little gold one yeah, um, so that one was from Tesco, the little gold sparkly one was from Tesco as well and then we also have this gold one as well which I think was from Next as well a couple of years ago um, 
And then ones like these, these are new ones from Next. This was one of our new collections from Next. This was like a pack of 50 for £10, which honestly, such a good deal. Um, so that also involves like these little ones and like these ones. So they're like gold um, and stuff. And then, so we also have like this one also came in the next collection. It's like an iridescent -y, sparkly, I don't know. It's like silver, but then there's like hints of blue in it too. Um, so like all the little iridescent -y ones, like these ones as well. Actually, no, come back to that one. Um, yeah, and like these ones, these, so these are like, yeah, I don't know if you can tell, but they're like blue, but like silver at the same time. <laughs> That's crazy. Um, so all those kind of ones, like I'll see around the tree, like the little ones and the big ones, they're all from next £10. I will link them down below because they're from this year. It's really, like, it's really nice. I mean, they feel a little cheap, but like, they're good, you know? Um, and then these ones, so there's lots of these little ones um, around and they're like one pound I think for a, like a bunch of ten potentially I think it was um, and they're from John Lewis. They had these in lots of different colours for their different collections so they had like these ones, they had a blush coloured one, they had silver, they had red ones, they had gold ones. We went for this more kind of coppery blush colour. It's kind of hard to tell in this light. It's a bit more blush than what it looks there. Um, then we've got ones like this one, which I made <laughs> uh, with Greg. Uh, it was from a DIY kit that my mum bought me two years ago for like make your own Christmas bubbles. So you basically got the Christmas bubble and you had to stick all these pins and sequins in, which took days because there's this one. There's a white one and then the blue ones down here. So there's like three different colours. So it took, uh, yeah, it took forever. And then there's another one of those John Lewis ones. Um, what else can I show you? Oh, this is another new one. So this one was from Asda. No, Tesco, sorry. He's a little fox and he's so cute. So it was like a three for two for this one. The little fawn and... Uh, something else, but I can't remember what. <laughs> um, and yeah, and then we also have these ones. I think these were from Ikea, like, uh, or Tesco or somewhere. Um, like four years ago, potentially. But they're really nice. I really, really like them. Oh, and then these ones. These were part of the pack for the next. So they get really nice bronze colour. They're gorgeous. Um, I've got ones like this, which are pure glass. Like, it's solid glass and it's like snow pear drop tape you no, I don't know what kind of teardrop raindrop but it's yeah and that one's from Ikea I believe too a few years ago this one was from next I believe last year um any other nice ones to point out this one was from Marks and Spencer's or John Lewis a few years ago it's white and red Probably better up in our stairs, upstairs collection, but oh well. Um, and then you've got this really heavy one. This one's like so heavy. I don't really know why it's in such a low down branch, but it is. Um, but yeah, it's solid. I think this one was from Ikea as well, or potentially John Lewis. I had a thing for John Lewis bubbles a few years ago, so a lot of these are going to be John Lewis ones. These were from Next last year, I believe. Pack of like three or four. Or were these from next this year? Oh, maybe these were from next this year actually. This one came in the pack with the 50 bubbles, so these ones. Um, I've also got this one, which was from uh, Marks and Spencer's, I believe, I think. Uh, I got these keys, like ceramic -y. Um, They were from Ikea. Got this one which was from Ikea again, it's glass and I think I've got two or three of these. Gave me a pack of two, they were from like three four years ago. Um, our star on the top 
it was like eight pound from Marks and Spencers. It's mirrored in glass. It's great. Um, but yeah, there's just like a collection of so many different types. There's some really nice Marks and Spencers ones in here, and John Lewis, and Next. Um, and yeah, just like so many different ones. Oh, these ones we bought this year from, um, where were these ones from? John Lewis, I believe. Um, they're metal. They're really nice. They weren't expensive either, which is nice. This one was from Marks and Spencers. They do these in gold and also in silver. Uh, again, they're glass, so really nice. Bit dangerous when you've got pets, but we live on the wild side. There's the white one from the DIY collection. Um, We've got some other nice like glass ones as well. And then we've got, oh that was the miss, that was the third one. So this is the mistletoe, for, again from Tesco, for two. Oh, look how nice they are. So these are the gold ones. So we've bought a pack of gold and a pack of bronzy ones. Um, But yeah, the bronze ones came from John Lewis. The more Air Destiny. They're just so, like, yeah. Can you shush? I'm trying to film. Thank you. Um, and then below our tree, which I know isn't part of a bubble, but it's a little tree skirt. Um, yeah. But yeah, there's just so many bubbles. Um, I will link them down below for you. Just like a lot of bubbles. I'll try and link all the ones that we bought this year from John Lewis and Next and Martin Spencer's down below. Um, I don't know if I can link the Tesco ones or not, but uh, if I can, I will. Um, but yeah, some really good ones. Uh, the packs from John Lewis and Nyx are beautiful. I love them and they're so inexpensive, like 50 for £10 from Nyx. And I think it was like 20 for £12, I think, from John Lewis. So not as good a deal, but like still pretty good. Um, so yeah, I'll link them all down below. And there's no new ones upstairs, I don't believe so. I don't think there's anything for me to link down there below. Um, but I'll see you tomorrow, hopefully, for another Christmas video where hopefully the lighting will be better than this. Bye.